Today's Doctrine and Tenno, and I'd like to get into trying to differentiate between Chiari, that's symptomatic, and CCI. Now, this is a common issue I see online and that patients ask about. Now, realize that Chiari malformation simply means that the back of the brain uh, hangs a little bit low. Now, there's Chiari 0, or CTE, and Chiari 1, and then there's 1 plus, and it goes 2, 3, etc. If you have a Chiari 0, CTE, or Chiari 1, many of those are asymptomatic. And it's actually believed right now, based on what's been published in the literature, that Chiari that's normally asymptomatic, meaning without symptoms, can become symptomatic due to craniocervical instability, or CCI. So if you're trying to figure out, should you treat the Chiari or the CCI in that case, then the CCI would be the one to focus on, because in all likelihood, if you get rid of the CCI component, hopefully through injection therapy rather than surgery, then the symptoms should die down and go away. Now, that might be different if you've got severe Chiari, obviously more than a one, or even a one with something like a syrinx. Uh, but if you don't have that, but you have symptoms, then usually getting rid of the CCI first makes the most sense. Hey, get this out to more patients by like, comment, share, subscribe. Thanks so much.